This is the Vitrium 61 Bahama Bay, which premiered recently at the Tuyap Istanbul Boat Show. The boat's powered by twin 700 horsepower IPS 900 engines, and the whole package will set you back around 1.5 million pounds X tax. With no flybridge or dinette on board, the cockpit is where you're going to do most of your eating on this boat, but that's okay with a couple of freestanding chairs and a transom mounted bench seat sitting around a very chunky wooden table. In each corner of the cockpit, you'll also find these two great lounging spots, above which you'll find a great, very secure, molded in handhold. Moving into the saloon, you'll find this very cool low slung seating, plenty big enough for a good party of guests. Opposite is the main sideboard with a flat screen TV built in and plenty of room above it for odds and ends. The helm position is very comprehensive with plenty of space for two big plotters although the steering wheel and throttles are a bit far away from the seat to fall easily to hand. What you do get though is this fantastic access to the side decks to make crewing that much easier. Down the curving companionway stairs you'll find the corridor galley which at first doesn't seem terribly practical but it does offer loads of storage and countertop space as well as four huge pull out drawer fridges. Just off the galley you'll find the master cabin which isn't quite as big as some of its competitors which will be full beam in most cases but it doesn't seem that much poorer for it surrounded by that gorgeous Veitchum cabinetry. There's plenty of storage solutions in the full height cupboards and there's a small vanity unit above which sits an integrally mounted flat screen TV. Moving further forward you'll find the rest of the boat's accommodation which is serviced by a day heads on the starboard side. On the port side there's a twin bunk guest cabin with a couple of opening ports to help ventilation and in the bow is the VIP cabin which offers a good amount of floor space at the foot of the bed and very good headroom. The massive foredeck is a feature of vintage line Veitchams, but this particular boat could have done with some sun pads to break up the white gel coat. Access to the top of the boat is via these stainless steel steps on the windscreen mullions. There's no flybridge option on the 61 Bahama Bay, but you do get enough space for a good sized tender, which is lifted off by the tender crane. So there you have the Veitchim 61 Bahama Bay. We're hopefully going to get on board again soon to bring you a full boat test in a future issue of MBY.